Hi guys, welcome to my channel El Loco Cars. In this video, I'll tell you about how cars are created and who invented first car. There are a lot of things to discuss in manufacturing of car like design, component, body, paint etc. So let's get started. There are many different types of automobiles, steam, electric, and gasoline, as well as countless styles. Exactly who invented the automobile is a matter of opinion. Earlier accounts often gave credit to Karl Benz, from Germany, for creating the first true automobile in 1886. How cars are created Introducing a new model of automobile generally takes 3 to 5 years from inception to assembly. Ideas for new models are developed to respond to unmet pubic needs and preferences. With the help of computer-aided design equipment, designers develop basic concept drawings that help them visualize the proposed vehicle's appearance. Chassis the typical car or truck is constructed from the ground up. The frame forms the base on which the body rests and from which all subsequent assembly components follow. From here the automobile frame moves to component assembly areas where complete front and rear suspensions, gas tanks, rear axles, and drive shafts, gear boxes, Steering box components, wheel drums, and braking systems are sequentially installed. Body Generally, the floor pan is the largest body component to which a multitude of panels and braces will subsequently be either welded or bolted. As it moves down the assembly line, held in place by clamping fixtures, the shell of the vehicle is built. First, the left and right quarter panels are robotically disengaged from pre-staged shipping containers and placed onto the floor pan, where they are stabilized with positioning fixtures and welded. The front and rear door pillars, roof, and body side panels are assembled in the same fashion. Prior to painting, the body must pass through a rigorous inspection process, the body in white operation. The shell of the vehicle passes through a brightly lit white room where it is fully wiped down by visual inspectors using cloth soaked in highlight oil. Under the lights, this oil allows inspectors to see any defects in the sheet metal body panels. Dings, dents, and any other defects are repaired right on the line by skilled body repairmen. After the shell has been fully inspected and repaired, the assembly conveyor carries it through a cleaning station where it is immersed and cleaned of all residual oil, dirt, and contaminants. The chassis assembly conveyor and the body shell conveyor meet at the stage of production. As the chassis passes the body conveyor the shell is robotically lifted from its conveyor fixtures and placed onto the car frame. Assembly workers, some at ground level and some in work pits beneath the conveyor, bolt the car body to the frame. Once the mating takes place the automobile proceeds down the line to receive final trim components, battery, tires, antifreeze, and gasoline. The vehicle can now be started. From here it is driven to a checkpoint off the line, where its engine is audited, its lights and horn checked, its tires balanced, and its charging system examined. Any defects discovered at this stage require that the car be taken to a central repair area. 
usually located near the end of the line. When the vehicle passes final audit it is given a price label and driven to a staging lot where it will await shipment to its destination. So, here is the complete video of how cars are created. If you like the video, then hit the like button and subscribe to our channel El Loco Cars for more interesting videos. Thanks.